we're at the uh, Disaster Expo in uh, Los Angeles Convention Center, and we have, uh, I believe it's John Peabody, Peabody. yes, mm -hmm. they're from Romer Industry, and he's one of the exhibitors, and he's going to share a little bit about what's going on with this uh, freezer, which is really wonderful. And actually, he's home based in San Diego, and I'd like to, for him to share a lot of this. So, you, all you uh, healthcare uh, individuals that are, are uh, purchasing products, we'd really love for you to look at this and hopefully buy as many as you can because this is really an excellent product, especially it's a freezer for medicine as well. Go ahead, John. Right. This unit is our second to uh, largest unit that we offer. We have smaller units as well. This one has a battery life of up to seven to ten days when it's not on any kind of power whatsoever. It also has an option to be solar powered and then it can run for indefinitely and uh, it plugs into a wall and charges the battery in seven to ten days. It's primarily for carrying vaccines, blood, platelets, and things like that. It's primarily used in a hospital type of environment. And like I said, we have multiple different units that are smaller that fit into ambulances or smaller uh, community outreach programs for vaccines to carry vaccinations. And so these are all different things. This is the new way that vaccine, blood, and even organs are being stored. Now, now John, thank you so much for sharing that. Uh, basically, you were actually uh, informing me regarding that this particular item right now at this point in time is about twenty thousand dollars i say at this point in time because it could right. go higher as, yeah. as time permits sure. and and basically you said it was like seven days that uh for uh for it to maintain itself without any type of electricity whatsoever Correct. and you can actually use solar or a car bat uh car charger to car be charger. actually be able to charge it as well that's really wonderful um it's kit and and so this is something that you know, like you said it could be used for vaccine and for yeah and for medicine or anything that actually that needs to be refrigerated and you indicated it might be about 20 degrees Celsius, is that what you said? Uh, yeah, or is so that correct? You can set the temperature to whatever temperature you want to keep your products at. Uh -huh. um, so 20 degrees Celsius would actually be you know, pretty warm. Okay. You could, get, you, you could set it up to be at 10 degrees Celsius, okay. 7 degrees Celsius, whatever temperature, whatever item you're placing it, uh -huh. it exists at or, or does best at, you can set it that temperature. It's completely has the ability for you to set the temperature within the unit. Okay, thank you so yeah. much, John. And John, yeah. here's some other products here as well that you have. They're a little bit of a smaller size and they're getting a little bit of a lesser value. But uh, again, this is only, I believe, this particular product that we have on hand that you're seeing here, which is, a, I believe the serial number is PRT25X425. And I believe that this is a 24 hours that it maintains itself for refrigeration yep. as long as without no uh, battery with, with the battery excuse me life on there and then we also have some smaller ones right here as well and um, John this These is will go like seven to ten hours battery powered uh, and then they also have the option to include the solar panel up here on top and then they can go for indefinitely you can see the temperature gauge on the side here that's where you can set your temperature, what you want to store at, and um, that's basically it. These units, this one's uh, about 4000 Okay, 4, and do you know, as far as warranty is concerned, how, um, can you tell me, like, how many years? Yeah, these are fully guaranteed. Battery, everything within. Um, batteries do need to be replaced at some point, but they have, like, a five-year life. So, just like batteries and everything, they, have, they, they do have a life where they don't charge as well as they did. So most of our customers they come back and get another battery and then we install it. Well, you know, I really thank you so much. And uh, if, if anybody wants to come here to the Disaster Expo, I believe they have it till today and tomorrow. We'll be here till tomorrow at 5 o'clock. And, um, yeah. and yeah, and, and if you need to feel free to call John Peabody. Again, here's his information. And it's right over here. And we hope you can purchase as much product as possible. Thank you so much for uh, being here. And have a great day. Thank you.